Welcome back. One of the biggest stars caught up in the so-called Varsity Blues College admission scandal facing a judge today. Actress Felicity Huffman pleading guilty to a single felony count of conspiracy. Yeah, in exchange for that plea, federal prosecutors agreed to recommend a sentence of four months imprisonment, a year of supervised release and a $20,000 fine. New at 4, ABC's Andrea Fuji has the very latest. A solemn looking Felicity Huffman made her way back to a Boston courthouse amid a sea of cameras holding her brother's hand. Inside, she formally pled guilty for her role in the so called Varsity Blues college admission scandal. Huffman, the former Desperate Housewives star, is one of 33 parents charged in the bribery scandal. In April, she signed a plea deal admitting to paying $15,000 to have an SAT proctor correct the answers on her daughter's exam, improving her daughter's score by 400 points. In an earlier statement, Huffman expressed deep regret and shame, writing, My daughter knew absolutely nothing about my actions. This transgression toward her and the public I will carry for the rest of my life. My desire to help my daughter is no excuse to break the law or engage in dishonesty. Huffman is now facing four to ten months behind bars, as well as a year of probation and a $20,000 fine. Meanwhile, actress Lori Loughlin and her fashion designer husband Massimo Giannulli are choosing to fight the charges. They're accused of paying half a million dollars to get their daughters recruited to the USC crew team, despite neither of them participating in the sport. Felicity Huffman is acting like someone who's just pled guilty. Lori Loughlin is acting like someone who feels like she doesn't belong there. Prosecutors and judges appreciate remorse. Court documents previewing the potential evidence include emails and wiretapped calls between Lachlan, her husband, and this man, Rick Singer, the alleged mastermind of the scheme who has since become a cooperating witness. And federal prosecutors are suggesting that more charges could be coming for parents, coaches, and even some adult children. Reporting in Boston, I'm Andrea Fuji, ABC News. All right, we'll continue to yep. follow the latest on this case. Two very different ways of handling exactly this. Exactly, see how they both end up. Yeah. Yep. All right.